Good morning, film students. I think we've all lived through a really rough 2020 so far. I was talking to my mom this weekend and she asked me what I was going to tell my students about what's been happening. And I said, Mom, a lot of stuff has been happening. They've had to live through so much history. And the five months that have gone by of this, this calendar year so far. When we went on hiatus from school back in March, one of the messages that I sent out to students was that living through history was painful and that we were in the pain of going home to be separated from everything for who knows how long. In March, we didn't know how long this pandemic was going to last. We didn't know what was going to happen. It was an uncertain time. And we are in another uncertain time as a film class we study the art that has been filmed from around the world in the last 130 years um, and you're also making your own this is the due date for your final film and several of you have submitted your posters and I are working on it and have contacted me for questions which I encourage you to do. For our class today I'm going to remind you of this site. This is the can't be part of the Los Angeles Public Library website. I'm going to post you this link and it has free movies that you can watch with your library account online for free. If you don't have a library account, it's a very easy process to get it online. Um, once you set it up online, you get your account, you can literally click and hit watch. One of the things that I always do is I make like uh, my own, you know, playlist or whatever it is that it's called, my view, my watch list. I don't know if you can hear the sirens in the background. There's been sirens all night. Um, I live in Echo Park, right next to Dodger Stadium, and that's been the staging ground for um, a lot of the police response. So I'm and all my neighbors and everybody who lives anywhere near here has been getting none but sirens. So if you hear some sirens in the background, I apologize. There's nothing I can do about it. Um, but I can lead you to this website. And I can recommend that you go to the documentary section on social and systemic injustice. And you can watch documentaries that have been made on the history of inequality in our country and what that has done to us as a society. The first one on the list is an outstanding film that was made um, out of the as it says down here. It was made out of the final writings of American author James Baldwin, who was planning a, and, and writing a book about the assassinations of three of his close friends, Medgar Evers, Malcolm X, and Martin Luther King Jr., who were viciously murdered in the 60s, a period of very great change and, and unrest in America. It's 
there's one that you could watch if you're interested. There are tons of things that you can watch on here um, for free. And you can't beat that deal. A lot of movies that you would have to normally stream um, with a, a, a paid streaming service are for free because you have a library card. And if you don't have a library card, they'll give you a library card. This is not Bravo's library card. This is the LA Public Library library card. And there are a lot of films here, as I had mentioned when I first posted this at the beginning of the semester. There's a lot of, a lot of films that you can select from, uh, including some of the you know films that we've studied um, in class. They have the Criterion Collection, which puts together a lot of films from the world, and you'll see some of these films that we have. Um, seen some clips of here's the seven samurai if you want to watch it again and a variety of other films that i wish we had time to look at but film is a record film is a document of times that people are living in if you're watching television and watching all of the turmoil that is in the streets and the medium that we used to watch it is film, whether it's a news film, whether it's an actual film like we just went over, the power of the moving image is vast. I encourage you to join in the community of people who pointed their camera at something and hit record in order to document that experience. Whether it was a fictional experience that you made up when you were making your film or a real life experience like we're seeing now. I miss you all. Please stay safe, stay healthy, and stay creative. Take care.